Hello, and welcome back to Knitting Nicely. I'm Danielle Chauvet, and today we're going to learn how to do the P C D D, which is a pearl central double decrease. Okay, that's quite a mouthful, but here we go. So with this decrease, you're going to be working on the pearl side, and you're gonna make three stitches into one, with the center one being central. So first you're going to find your yarn, <laughs> and then you're going to actually slip stitches knitwise, two of them. So two stitches knitwise. And then you're gonna slip those two stitches back over to your left needle. And then you're going to slip them again to your right needle through the back together like this. Make sure you're not splitting your yarn, but it goes through the back of those two stitches together. I think I was splitting my yarn here, so let's try that again. Through the back, knitwise, or purlwise, through the back. Okay, and then you're gonna slip those stitches back to the left needle again. <laughs> it's quite the process. And then you'll purl through all three stitches. The reason why you have to slip them back and forth, back and forth is because basically what you're doing is you're twisting those stitches to be in the right orientation so that when you're done with your decrease, you'll have the center one um, showing. And I'll show you at, that at the end of the video, what it looks like on the front side of your work. So, slow motion. First, we slip one stitch and slip a second stitch. Both of these are slipped knitwise, one at a time. Then you'll slip both of those back over to your left needle, purlwise. So you've twisted those two stitches. Now you're going to actually twist them again by slipping your right needle through the back of both of them at the same time, okay? So slip your right hand needle through the back of them both at the same time. Make sure you don't split your yarn and make sure that you've got both of those two stitches on your right needle. So I'm gonna slip that back again because I think I split my yarn when I was making this video. Okay, so I'm just making sure that they're on there correctly. And I've got them on correctly, so I'm gonna slip them over to my right needle. And then I'm gonna slip those two stitches right back over to my left needle again. And now they are in the correct orientation so that I can purl straight through all three stitches for my double decrease, which I will do here. I grab all three together and then purl through all three of those stitches. The first two have been twisted in a way to make them the correct orientation. And now I just purl through all three. Okay, let's speed it up again. So. Knit wise, slip one, knit wise, slip another one, slip them purl wise back over to your left needle, then slip them through the back loop together, back over to your right needle, and then slip them off, and then move them back over to your left needle. Now they're in the right orientation, they're twisted correctly, and then you purl through all three of those stitches at the same time for your double decrease. Okay, so now I'm gonna turn the work around after I fix my splitting yarn, and I'll show you um, what it looks like on the front. So I'm gonna purl a couple stitches here just to get away from that de double decrease. And this is what it looks like on the front of your work. You have a nice little center line coming up with your double decreases. All right, so I hope you enjoyed learning this one. This one's a little bit complicated, but it was still fun and it has a nice result. If you enjoyed watching this, please hit the like button. And if you'd like to get more videos from Knitting Nicely, please subscribe. And as always, happy knitting.